You know that razor wire that Texas Governor Greg Abbott has been stringing up along parts of the southern border? It looks like this. Well, the U.S. Supreme Court just said today the Biden administration has every right to cut it down, at least for now. The ruling on this emergency request came down today, and it's just this one paragraph that overturns a lower court ruling. The justices gave no reason for why they were ruling this way, as is typical with these types of emergency requests. This ruling just allows the Biden administration to cut down the razor wire while the case into whether the wire is legal at all continues to play out in the lower courts. Now, it's important there was a note on today's order that said Justices Thomas, Alito, Gorsuch, and Kavanaugh would have rejected the Biden administration's request and would have allowed the razor wire to stay. So what's going on? Well, if you've been paying attention at all, you know there is a crisis happening at the southern border. The governor of Texas has taken several controversial steps to address the flow of migrants coming into his state like putting up the razor wire along portions of the Rio Grande. The problem with that is, generally, border security is the job of the federal government, not the state government. So under the authority of the Biden administration, Border Patrol agents started cutting down that wire, saying it was preventing Border Patrol agents from doing their jobs and reaching these migrants who had already crossed onto U.S. soil. Governor Abbott sued the Biden administration, claiming the agents had trespassed and had damaged state property by cutting the wire. Well. This case is currently being heard by the Fifth Circuit Court of Appeals, and that case will continue on. But in the meantime, this ruling by the Supreme Court today allows the Biden administration's Border Patrol to cut down that wire so they can continue to do their jobs while the case plays out.